Hello everybody, I am Ann Robinson. Welcome to my channel where it is awesome to be Ann and it is awesome to be you. I'm coming at you. Yes, it is. It is Saturday morning. Um, it is September the 12th and uh, yeah, I decided to make a random uh, video. Uh, it, it has been what a month of Monday since I have done a makeup video, mainly because um, I have been enjoying going all natural. <laughs> yeah, keeping it natural, keeping it simple, uh, slapping on maybe some eyeshadow here and there, uh, slapping on some lip gloss and uh, yeah, or some lipstick occasionally and just going with it. Uh, so today um, I was playing around one night this week and I was thinking that I was going to make up my face before work one morning and uh, it didn't happen. I was doing other things and I didn't have time to even do it. So um, I said, oh, why not? Come on, just have fun. Say hello to everybody. And uh, yeah, do a get ready with me. So uh, I've got my little makeup bag where I was going through uh, shopping my makeup stash because I've been watching a few um, makeup videos of some uh, some of my uh, favorite uh, sub people that I'm subscribed to and um, because they're all my favorites if I'm watching then you're a favorite um, and I just got inspired I said okay let me let me um, look through my stash and I'm always excited when I see what I have and I'll be like man I forgot about that so here I am and uh, I'm gonna stop talking so let me show you I'm using one of my lip monthly bags and I'm gonna just pull out everything that I'm gonna be using uh, this is my NYX uh, shine killer so I will be using that um, this is something that I got in, I believe it was my Ipsy bag. This is the Tarte and, um, it's a bronzer, but of course I'm going to be utilizing it as an eyeshadow. I'm trying to remember the look that I was trying to create. So y'all going to see me do this right up front. Oh, this is something, um, that I haven't used in a while. I haven't used a lot of things in a while, but this is one of them. Uh, this is Black Radiance, um, camouflage, uh, concealer stick. Yeah, Black Radiance Concealer Stick. So I'm going to be using that. And it's pretty neat because it's made like a lipstick and it's just easy to apply. All right, and something wow. When I opened this up and I checked, I said, oh my God, I forgot all about this. This here is a bronzing powder as well. And when I looked at this, it's called All Over Glow. And it's in the shade Bronze Glow. And um, it is uh, Ruby Kisses, I believe. And look at this. When I looked at this, I said, oh my God, that looks like the sun. It's not even doing any justice to that right now because it is so 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 bright all right and the next item that i'm pulling out is mac i may use this i may want to put some powder i may not um it's a saturday i'm going to be chilling it's going to be raining it looks like it's trying to be a gloomy doomy day but there's no gloom going on what on the inside so yeah so this is my this is mac in deepest dark and here's what it looks like face powder <laughs> um, of course I have um, this Mac in uh, and it's a paint pot in soft okra and I have oh this is elf blush and what I intended, and this is in the shade Candid Coral, and I actually was going to use this um, not as a blush, but as a an, as an eyeshadow, I believe. So yeah, let me let me uh, you know you can do that. You know you can you make your uh, makeup multi-purpose. <laughs> yes, all right. And this here is um, my Black Radiance. It's a blush. And it is in raspberry, which is such a beautiful, beautiful color. I, I don't know. I might, I may tweak this and change it out for another. I had packed this earlier this week. I think I want to put another color on my cheeks, but we'll go with it for now. And this here, oh, a while back, <laughs> people, ladies, gentlemen, I had, um, got my Ipsy bag and in my Ipsy bag, I had, uh, I think I had, um, chosen to get, um, the buxom eyeshadow as one of my, um, you know, one of my extras. And, um, 
And when I got it, I just had, I, I couldn't find the case when I did the video. I mean, I got the case and I didn't have the shadow. And I was like, God, they sent me a buxom case that's empty. No, they didn't. It was actually hidden inside the inside the uh, the beautiful fuchsia ipsy bag that it comes in, the pack in, packaging. So there is the shade that that is. And um, of course, I can't tell you what shade it is. Okay, but. It's a beautiful brown kind of color. <laughs> okay, so let me get started. I've talked five minutes already. Let me go ahead and get started. And I'm going to pause it so I can get myself together here. And I'm um, right now putting on my NYX Shine Killer. You know, so to speak, to prime the face, you know, to make your um, makeup kind of hold to your face a little bit better. That's what I'm going to call it. It's good if you're a foundation wear. It makes a good base so that your foundation can hold to your face really, really great without moving all over the place. So that is done. And uh, what I want to do next, people, okay, I'm going to do my, um, do my, prime my eyes. How about that with this soft okra? I'm going to do that really quickly. We don't want to prolong this video too long. Slap, slap, slap. It's just going to be a simple routine, um, ladies. Okay. Got that on? Look at there. All right. All right. And it's all on. Eyes are all prime. The next thing that I'm going to use is my concealer stick. And this is what it looks like. We're going to slap that on. This is in, um, it's 8001 which I think is a dark. It might be a medium, but I think this is like a dark. So we're going to slap that on. You see how that's looking? We're going to slap that on right up in there. Get rid of some of the dark circle. And there it is. And that's the only place that I'm going to put that. Slide that over there. And I got my mirror right here, so I'm hoping that you can see this pretty good. We're just going to blend this in. Remember, I need to go a little easy right there in that area. All right. All right. All right. All right, and that is all done. Yeah, all right. What am I going to do next? Well, I am going to, uh, yeah, go ahead and start doing um, my eye makeup. How about that? I decided to go with my It brushes that I got as a Mother's Day gift, and I haven't used them too often. So let's work with that. Let's see how well I can do it just working with these brushes all by themselves. So what am I going to put over my eyelid as a whole? I'm going to take and use the e.l.f. blush I said in this Candid Coral. And um, I'm going to put this um, all over the lid. Okay. How about that? Well, let's see. First of all, let's do this. I want to go and do the um, transition color first. I'm going to do that and then nah, yeah. I'm going to put that first. Let's do it like that, I, I guess. It doesn't matter. I'm going to just do that. So I'm going to use this little bronzy color in the crease just to um, get it get a, uh, get it going here. Wait a minute. Let's see if I can get this. I'll work it out, people. I may take this all the way up into the crease and all the way up. Okay? Yeah. I hope, it, you know, it's, it's really... This bronze, you know, I can't use it as a contour or nothing like that, or even as a bronzer, so to speak. So it has to be used as a um, an eyeshadow. And this is the Tarte bronzer. And we're going to get that in, into that crease and up to what? Underneath the brow. That's how we're going to work this today. Guess what? Guess who surprised me? Yeah, this is going to be a chit chat. Guess who surprised me and showed up? Yeah, um, my kids all have still have the key to the front door. 
And I was thinking, I kept calling out each of my kids' names that were here, because you know my son is, is away at college, my youngest. And I'm like, Josh, is that you? Shalana, is that you? And lo and behold, it was my Elijah. He don't quite arrive with a, one of his um, classmates. And he's home. Yeah, he'll be here for today. And he has to go back by tomorrow because he has football um, practice. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm so glad to see him. I know it's taking me forever on this one eye, people. I'm just trying to get it, get it in there. Let me pause this for a second. Okay, so now I'm going to take this um, candid coral blusher and put it on the mobile lid. Okay, I guess this week I was thinking summer <laughs> when I packed this little makeup bag uh, for the next day to put on makeup, trying to be all prepared and organized and didn't even do it. But yeah, I guess I was thinking of a summertime kind of thing like... um an illuminating look because in a glowy look because all of these colors are very springy very summery and will brighten lighten all of that so yeah i'm just gonna put this pinky um curly um shade peachy shade not pinky on this mobile lid <laughs> All right, then I'm going to grab out of here. Um, well, I know I could probably still work with this one brush. I tell you, that's why you need many brushes because all brushes don't work for the same thing. But I'm going to stick to using just what I got. And I'm going to go into this Buxom um, eyeshadow. And I'm going to do the little, darken it up a little bit. It's too much light bright going on on this here eye. And um, yeah, we're going to darken it up a little bit. We're going to take and put... Some in the corner. And then we're going to take it on up and just do it like that right there in this little V shape. Okay, just kind of add a little depth and darkness to this light look. And I'm going to do the other eye and I'll be back. Guess what I was about to forget to do, people? Um, I didn't choose a brow anything so i am using the it cosmetics um brow power um yeah and this is in universal taupe okay so i'm gonna do my brows all right this is what it looks like and i've been using it i use it a couple of days this week because if i don't do anything i do my brows every day and i put on just a lip gloss and go so every day i do my brows all right, so we're going to go ahead and fill these in, fill in my brows, just where it's looking a little sparse. And on the other side of this, it has a little, you know, spoolie where you can kind of, you know, brush. So let me pause and finish this. My brows are all done, and I actually got this It Brow po Cosmetics Brow Power in my Ipsy bag, and I thought this was an excellent thing that they could have given. So, yeah, um, let me stick this back over here. And um, I believe, um, what else do I need to do here? Because it seems like I'm missing something else. But let me go ahead and powder. Um, no, not powder. Let's see. Powder my face. Well, this, ain't, this is not what I'm going to use. Sorry, people. Here we go. <laughs> Powder my face up really quickly. And um, I think I could use my brush to do that. So which, which brush do I want to use? I guess I can use my, um, this is the um, air, airbrush powder brush from IT. I'm going to dibble dabble. I'm just going to do it real lightly because I, I really don't need foundation. My skin is pretty even toned. I'm just going to kind of brush over it just to give it a little finish looking also to get rid of some of this brightness under my eye. Yeah, there you go. And I'm going to do that and finish out and I'll be back. Now my favorite eyeliner, yes, I forgot liner to put in my makeup bag. It's Jessie's, that Jessie's Girls. I think that's what it is. And it is wonderful and it has a little pin. Oh, it's just perfect. But I'm going to use be using e.l.f. Okay to um, do that and so I'm going to do one eye and then shut this down. I don't want the video to be super long. 
And this just look at that. Perfect. Just perfect. I'm going to do the other eye and come back. All right. And how could I forget mascara? So I'm using uh, the NYC. Um, and this is lengthening mascara sky rise and i got this in i believe it was um my ipsy bag so uh, let me go ahead and put some of that on i'm really wanting to get back to the point where i just keep my makeup routine very simple years ago i, I barely wore any makeup um, and uh, YouTube has made me just fall in love with so many different parts of the uh, 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 products uh, that is and uh, parts of makeup, you know, routines to do that. It's just, um, yeah, it can be complicated, <laughs> but we want to keep it fun. And if I don't do anything, I love my my eyeshadow and I'm going to make sure I have that on and I love my lip products. So, and of course, guys, yeah, I'm sure you can tell that I got cut off. <laughs> I had to delete a few things. So, yeah, I was uh, finishing up putting on my mascara. And now I am at the point of where I have now decided that I'm going to switch out. And I'm not going to use this blush. I'm going to go with <clears throat> the City Colors Rosy Cheeks. And this is Antique Rose, which I think is such a beautiful color antique rose yes so i'm gonna put that on all right just pause and hold that thought for a second okay so let's go ahead and put on some of this um some of this i decided to go with what is this uh it has the name on here this is well it says airbrush foundation but we're going to use it for blush okay because it's just a perfect size okay so yeah put a little on It'll be a little natural, a little natural look, ladies. All right. Antique rose. Yeah. Now I'm going to use this right here, this little little um, brush here, and I'm going to put on, this is for concealer, but I'm going to use it um, to put on my highlight and use this bronzer as a highlight, okay? Yeah, make it look like my skin has been kissed by the sun. I think it looks that way anyway, but oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's go ahead and slap some of that on. Can y'all see that? Look at that. And we're going to blend that out. All right, and I'll be back once I've done the other side. And guess what I forgot? I forgot to put a little liner. It does make it little look better right here underneath my lashes. So I am going to use Exaggerate by Rimmel. And it is um, in the uh, blackest black. Okay, the blackest black. So let me go ahead and do that really quickly. I think it just really adds something to the eye when you line the bottom which I don't always do. There you go. See how that brightened it up or did something to it. Made it look real sassy. All right. And um, that is that is it. And guess what? I almost forgot. Let me pick out my liner and I'll be right back. Guess what? I am getting ready to do what? <laughs> Throw some shade your way yes i am so i got my um nk lip pencil and coffee okay so let me go ahead and line my lips first I'm not going to take too much time doing that. All right. And my lips are all lined. All right. And we're going to put this away. Guess what lipstick I chose? 
So I'm choosing a MAC lipstick. And this is, Re this is uh, Viva Glam Rihanna 2. Yes. I figured this would go good with my earthy kind of suntanny kind of look. Yeah. All right. So let's go ahead and put that on. All right. And that is going to do it for this look. All right. How you like how you like me now? <laughs> all right, got yeah, ladies, guys, if you're watching. All right, stop it for just a sec. Okay, I am back, and we're just going to do what in up close? Yeah. Yeah. All right, and that is it. Yes. I want to thank you so much for watching, and uh, I will see you where in my next video. Peace and blessings. Wood. Until next time.